Hi everybody, how are you? It's Leslie from Leslie's Creative Studio and welcome to the hop. So what we're going to make is something that's really easy and that people um, use a lot in their journals and it's called a coin envelope. So easy. So I have a piece of craft cardstock that I cut at three and a half inches and then I cut three quarters of an inch off the top. So what I'm going to do right now, yeah, I hope I don't make too much noise doing that. I've done that. I'm going to, well, actually, before I do that, stop and think for a second. I'm going to score this at four and a half down the middle. So I believe that's where I want it, correct? Yes, four and a half. Okay, there we go. Four and a half down the middle. Sorry, I hope I wasn't out of camera view. I'm going to try it on my side now. And then I'm going to score a quarter inch on each side. That is done. I'm going to move my scoreboard. Now, this longer part is going to be my top. You can see the score marks. And this is going to be my bottom. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm just going to pull this up just so I have my bottom set. Kind of got a nice crease with my bone folder. And I'm going to bring this back real quick. Um, so I'm going to take the line right there where the top is. This is going to be my lip. I just like to give that a crease um, so it folds a little bit easier. Like such. Okay, so this is what we're going to do. Scissors, scissors, yes, we have our scissors. I'm going to cut the bottom. Well, just inside my score lines. And snip. And cut. And then I'm going to trim here, and I'm going to trim here, so that looks okay there. All right, and then these are going to get folded in. This is the lines that we scored at a quarter inch. Okay, so I don't want any extra, so I'm going to trim that there. Oh my God, it's a little bit, I don't want any bulk. So I think what I'm going to do actually is I'm going to trim there, I'm going to trim a little bit there. Flip this over, I'm going to trim a little bit there. Flip this over, trim a little bit there. Get all these little scraps out of the way. And then what I'm going to do, where is my punch? Take my hole punch. And I'm going to... On the part that's the bottom, I'm going to come in about halfway. And gave it my best eyeball shot. And cut my punch there. Right now, what I'm going to do, take my handy dandy aqua gun, glue, not gun, glue gun. It's not a glue gun. 
it's a glue pen stick thing but I really love this glue it's uh I like the fact that it has a fine tip on it okay so now I'm just going to hold this up make sure it's pretty even on both sides as you know paper likes to move if you're hearing thunder in the background I apologize we have been having some pretty nasty storms all evening here in Indianapolis so my house has been shaking yeah for probably um past couple hours I still want this cut more There we go. I think that looks a little better. Let's give that a good fold. Give this a real good press. Give that a press. Give that a press. And there you have it. Look. Easy peasy coin folder to use in your journals. And if you glue this down on a tag, let me see something. I think I've got a tag here. I think I did some tags. Where are they? Goodness gracious. I can never find anything when I need it. Well, just say, for instance, I'll take this piece of paper. If you glue this, say this was a, say this was a tag, and you glue this on the front of your tag, this way, sorry. So if you just glued here, here, and here, and left this part open, so then you not only have... You know a tuck spot here but you would also have one here so it's like a double tuck spot so that is my um, my video for the hop you can ink the edges you can decorate this any way you want um, these are so awesome I just love them and they're so easy to make easy peasy um, I will, if you want the, if you want the dimensions of how I cut that, if you didn't catch it when I was taping, um, just let me know and I'll put those back out there. Ooh, this is sticking out a little bit. I just want to trim that. There we go. So again, easy peasy. And like I said, you can decorate them any way you want. So that's it. I hope you enjoy the hop. Be sure to check the description below for the other girls who are participating. And um, just click the next link and have a blast. Happy hopping, everybody. Bye-bye.